Welcome to another Ask Arlington. I'm Jay Warren. Ask Arlington is a show that is dedicated to answering the questions that you have about what's happening here in our community. And on this episode, we are focusing on National Night Out with the Arlington Police Department. Now, National Night Out, held Tuesday, October 3rd, promotes crime prevention and police community partnerships with Arlington neighborhoods. It encourages people to turn on their porch lights, step outside, and get to know their neighbors as small block parties that will be happening all across Arlington. And joining me now to help talk about this and, and educate us a little bit more about the program is Michelle Benjamin. Michelle is a crime prevention specialist with yes. the City of Arlington's Police Department. Michelle, yes. thank you for being here. Oh, thank you for having me. And before we jump into our resident questions, we got some good ones. We wondered if you could tell us a little bit more about National Night Out and why it is so important here in Arlington, because it's a big deal in yes, our city, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yeah. Basically, National Night Out is the one night out the year where the whole country comes outside, turns on the porch light, and stand, basically let criminals know we do not tolerate crime here. Yeah. Um, because Texas is so hot, yeah. um, Texas actually has it the, the first Tuesday in October. Yeah. Everybody else in the country has it the first Tuesday in August. Okay. Um, Basically what happens is everybody comes out, you get to know your neighbors. If people moved in, mm -hmm. they get to know who's living on their block. It's just fun fellowship for everybody in Arlington. And it just generates more and more excitement each year. And we should point out, because this is a big deal, as we mentioned, for Arlington, we compete very strongly nationwide in the number of parties and the number of uh, participants that we have in this program. Tell us a little bit about that, because we're like number two in the nation, right? Yes. Um, National Idol is actually hosted by National Association of Town Watch, and they have um, a small package deal where they look at how many people participate, they look at the advertising that you know we put on as a city, um, they look at you know, has it increased in participation each year. They just look at the full range of basically putting on this program on. Yeah. And what they do is they judge every city's elements uh -huh. and then we get rankings at the end. Yeah. So last year we got second, which is a big deal. In the whole the, nation. Yes, in the yeah. nation. Um, over the past 10 years, we stopped, stayed in the top 10, but starting 2012, we hit top five, uh -huh. and we've just been increasing ever since. That is awesome. There's a lot of pride in that for sure. Yes, so. it is. All right, well, let's get to some of our resident questions. Maybe that will get more people out this year, and we can get to number one. We'll All see, right. right? All right, so our first question comes to us from D, and D writes in, how do we go about inviting our neighbors to National Night Out? Uh, do I invite the whole neighborhood uh, of over 300 people or just my street? So is it is it smaller blocks, or is it like the larger neighborhood? Well, that's an excellent question. Basically, it's whoever you want to invite. We have some neighborhoods that invite every single house in their neighborhood. Yeah. And we have some areas that just invite the people on their street. So our parties range from two people all the way up to a thousand. Right. So it's wide range of sizes. There's no rules. Create your party however you want. Some neighborhoods have an ice cream social. Mm -hmm. Other neighborhoods have a big affair where they have um, jump houses and one neighborhood last year she told me that she had a truck where the kids could play video games. There's no limit to what That's you could awesome. do for your party. So you could be your own house and you just invite people over to your house. It could be the block. It could be the whole neighborhood. Mm -hmm. It really runs the gamut. It could gamut. be anything. The whole purpose yeah. of National Night Out is just getting out of your yeah. house. Um, make sure you lock your door, of course. Turn on your porch light. And like I said, it could be any the, the neighbors around you. Uh -huh. It could be the two streets over. It could just be the whole section of the city. It really just depends on the party planner. Yeah, and the, the key is getting to know your neighbors. The more you know your neighbors, the more you're going to look out for each other, yes. the more you're going to send a signal that crime isn't going to be here in our neighborhood. Exactly. So you're, it's, it's all about a building process, which yes, is great. Is. National Night Out is good for that. All right, well, our next question comes to us from Lisa. Lisa, I'm, I'm sorry, from Nancy. And Nancy writes in, how do we know if our neighborhood is signed up. So it, let's say you live in a neighborhood, maybe you're new because you mentioned this, is, this does sometimes happen for, for people who moved into a neighborhood. How do you know where the party is and if you're signed up? Oh, that's great. So what you're going to do is you're going to arlingtx.gov slash NNO and there's a map of all the registered oh, wow. parties. 
so you can zoom in or zoom out and see if there's a party on your street. Uh, for some streets, it's four or five parties. Yeah. Um, other streets, there might be one party a couple blocks down, mm -hmm. um, but that's updated re real time. So um, just go on the website anytime and look at the map and you'll see where the parties are. And if you go to that map, I'm, I'm guessing, I haven't seen it yet, but there are going to be a lot of little dots on there because yes. we were, had 196 parties last, last year. year, so you're hoping to break that this year, right? Yes, I am. Yeah, very yes, good. I am. So far, we have over 170, and it's growing. So go ahead and register your party right now. Yeah, that's <laughs> awesome. Very good. All right, now our last question does come to us from Lisa. Uh, it's a little off topic from National Night Out, but we thought it would be important because some of the uh, programming that we put on our video uh, cable channel actually is about National Night Out. So there is, awesome. a, there is a related component here. But Lisa writes in, what channel is My Arlington TV on? Uh, so let me tell you a little bit about that, Lisa. You can watch this show, Ask Arlington, and many, many others that we produce here at the City of Arlington on channel 99 if you have AT&T UVerse, and we're on channel 16 if you're on Spectrum, which is the old time Warner. Uh, and a couple of notes here. If you're not on either of those channels, you can still watch all of our programming because we put everything out on our YouTube channel. So all you have to do is go to the city's YouTube channel and you'll see this Ask Arlington episode that we've got here. But in addition to that, we have a host of original programming from Arlington Eats to Backstage Arlington to On the Clock. It's a long list of things that you can watch to learn more about our community on a regular basis. So, but before we get to anything else here, let me thank Michelle for coming in. We really oh, do appreciate you, you being here today. And we appreciate all the hard work that you're doing for National Night Out and to make our community a better place to live, learn, work, and play. Thank you. Thank you. And we're gonna keep our fingers crossed that we cross the 196, let's say 200 parties this year. <laughs> that would be great. All right, Michelle, thanks. And thanks to all of you at home for writing in and sending those great questions. That will do it for this week's Ask Arlington. Tune in next time where we'll answer some more of your questions.